So I had to do my first roadie return today out of, I think, 50 gigs I've done so far. This is the first time I've ever had to do a return upon not being able to complete the delivery. So the order was a leaf blower that went from the Home Depot to a storage unit. And it was about 7 a.m. when I accepted the order. I got there about 7.30 with the leaf blower. And the business wasn't open until I think 8.30 or 9.30 it said. Anyways, there wasn't anybody that I could get a hold of. It's not a spot where I could just leave it at the doorstep. It would definitely get stolen being in the area I'm in. So on the app, I said that I have a delivery issue, said I couldn't complete the delivery, and then a countdown timer started. I think it was five minutes. And once that timer ran out, it directed me to take the item back to the Home Depot. And I did that. And then upon doing that, I found out that I got paid for the initial delivery I couldn't complete, plus taking it back to the Home Depot, which they gave me the same amount that I was quoted for the initial delivery. So I basically got double what I was going to get for just doing the delivery for taking it back to the Home Depot. So that was a pleasant surprise. Probably one of the best return delivery policies I've encountered on the different gig apps I've done so far. So that's a plus. <laughs>